welcome in that Gandalf gaming. <laughs> I'm guessing you've got the FGG at the start for people to abbreviate your name. I'm not too bad. Just getting some tasks done in a more. Getting some of the logging done. I don't know how these logs will go going through the tunnel, so I'm going to bring a log truck. That's the wrong map, that one. That's where I want. Got to bring a log truck over to that one to repack it to be safe to go through the tunnel. What the? Don't even know why that screen opened. How are you doing today? No, I haven't used any mods yet. As I say to people, I like to complete the game as intended by the devs before I do any modding. And with SnowRunner being such a huge game, I don't know if I'll even mod it. Because it just takes forever to play. By the time I'll finish it, I want to move on to other games. I personally think most of the mods for this, other than the, well, all the vehicle mods, are pretty much overpowered. They just make things too easy. And the whole game's about the challenge. Nothing against those that do use the mods, though. It is a single-player game, so... I've been playing this for almost, it'd be almost coming up close to 550 hours in the one playthrough. Yeah, I usually only play vanilla. There's three games that I've used mods with. One being Skyrim, where I only use one mod for knowing which books I've read and haven't read. Oops. I also use mods in American Truck Simulator, but the mods I use there I make myself. It's same with Euro Truck Simulator too. I also make the mods myself. I keep teleporting through the tunnel by accident. Uh-oh, my steering wheel's turning right. Ah, good. That's what I wanted. On my way up to this spot, the logs unpacked from the trailer and moved themselves to the truck. <laughs> it's 
So I kind of moved the rest of the way. Keep pushing her the wrong way. That's probably a bit too far back, I think. See how that goes. Not enough logs. Don't tell me that. Oh, one of the logs fell off down there. That is annoying. This has got enough cargo. I was half thinking, should I take the trailer behind this? But then I've got the trailer unpacked behind this so might be better just to grab the one log and balance it on the back and drive back up here now the mods I'm making Euro truck is I've got one that unlocks all the accessories and everything for level locked accessories. I've I've spent over eight and a half or well, eight hundred and fifty hours in the game and one profile over a hundred and forty four, level hundred and forty four, another profile over a hundred over sixty. So it's not like I'm haven't played it from the start before so I feel comfortable to make that mod I also make a mod to allow doubles in every country because in Australia we see doubles all over the place Ah uh, yes, fair enough. I've got friends that play, well I know streamers that play this one with just keyboard and others that play it with a controller. I use steering wheel. Same with um, American truck and Euro truck. So it's not like you need a certain setup to be able to play them.
that's how I'm gonna do that one and I'll hold it on there like that until I get back to the trailer okay nice Thrustmaster wheel I've got the G29 or Logitech G29 I like how you can do everything in this game on the steering wheel or almost everything except move the camera in crane mode basically I've also got a shifter for it okay uh, ads, yep. <laughs> uh oh. You're back, and I've lost the log. Yeah, I've got, for my setup, I've got a, I think it's a 32 inch TV as a second screen for my laptop, which is, I think a 17 inch screen. Then I have an older laptop which I use while streaming for seeing chat and stuff which is a 15 inch screen linked to a 40 inch TV Why does the crane creep keep dropping it? There we go. That should do it. <laughs> that is certainly a lot of screens. I've got my gaming laptop to the left of me. The 32 inch screen, inch TV in front of me which I use, which I play the games on. Then I've got my older laptop to the right of me with chat on it and some information for the stream then the 40 inch TV that that's linked to above my center screen But it's not a true two PC streaming setup because I don't have a capture card. I don't play on one stream from another.
Awesome. Got it. That makes me think. I don't think him. I've even got a picture of my setup in my Discord. I really should. Got it. Seems good. Now let's hope that would be enough. Looks like it is. I wish we could make roads like this around the place more often. I don't even know where to get the oversized cargo from yet. I think I might go and sell this trailer first. Yes, this is DLC. This is Amour, A M U R. Yeah, the base game Russia map doesn't have any snow. The Two. Yeah, I think there's two Russian maps in Year One DLC, which are Kola Peninsula and Amor. Both of those are covered in snow. I've only got Year One. I don't have Year Two DLC, and this is the last map in Year One. This was Season Four. And also my last map I need to complete. The truck I'm driving only just got on this map today. Pretty insane truck though. I've got a perfect emote when I get stuck like that.
made it myself for that purpose. I would say, well, personally I didn't buy any of the DLC trucks. The only DLC pack I've bought is Year One. And it is very, very much worth it because I can't remember how much it is, but I've currently got over 500 hours in the game and I, that's all in one playthrough. So yeah, I will definitely recommend getting year one. I haven't got year two myself either, so I can't really recommend that as I haven't played it. Well, e emotes Twitch does resize to the appropriate sizes themselves. That one I made there, I also made one other, which I don't know if I have on my tablet for quick. No. Can't show the other one I've made. But in my emotes, it's the one with high. I've made those on a 200 pixel by 200 pixel square paint document then use different programs to make background clear and make it animated and all that make the other one animated There's one lot of short vlogs done. Should I continue doing two more small logs, short logs, or should I go on to do these? Both of those can be collected, picked up at the same place, down here. It's got two bricks and unlimited metal beams. Sure. What quote would you like to add? I do ask that it's either said in chat as a quote, I've said it, or it's from the game. Though. So it is stream related, not just a random quote. Oh, I can pick those up from there. I'll do that now then. I will head down the bottom, get the metal beams and bricks. Ah, yeah. Yeah, I do prefer to for them to be... Related to the stream somehow. I don't really have too many quotes, so 
if you do see something that happens quote worthy feel free to quote it I think I've only got six at the moment If you want to do the um, X, actually I might be able to, I can't do individual ones, but I can, that's the, that was created today. Yeah, that one was um, set in chat by Munchie Pickles. Why did I do the same one twice? <laughs> that one I said at some point. Yeah, that one I done, I think that was last week, maybe the week before, yeah, a couple weeks ago. I was towing a car down a hill, well, I was driving a car down, well, with the trailer down a hill that was black ice, and the trailer kind of flung around and rolled over and slid down the hill more. It's just repeating the same ones. Come on, why did why'd you do that twice? You're supposed to be random. Where's the other ones? Come on. I don't even know which ones it's missed, but if you want to do the exclamation point in quote and then space a number, it'll tell you the specific one. Why have I come in here? That's not where I want. Yeah, spamming my own chat with quotes. <laughs> While I'm here, I might do this one. me by accident so service spare parts that one that's not where I wanted to put it that's okay I'll go deliver these and then I'll go pick up the other stuff Wait a minute. With these ones, I want to cross the water. So I need to turn around again.
Hopefully I can get through this bottom part. 